Good morning, Shipbreaker. Lynx would like to share the following message. The only peas permitted in the salvage yard are profit, processor, and potassium trifluoromethane sulfonate. Oddly Pacific. Good morning. Rise and shine, Cutter. Good morning. Hope you feel well rested. Ready to continue your training? Okay. Let's have a look at your employee terminal. Now, sure, why let's not? get caught up on career progression and certification. I've sent you a message with an explanation. Go on and give it a read. Ooh, six new messages. Certification. Clear, don't worry, I'm here to walk you through the process. And then Soon enough, I'm going to introduce you to some of the other shipbreakers. Most of them are willing to help you out, too. All right, let's start a new ship and pick your first ship to work on. Huh. Thanks. Wait, is this just basic tutorials? Wait, no. Comes with a price. Friends and family, but I was here for a new cost. Fortunately, these shows bone their cost temporarily in order to let you hit ground running, begin training in a stress free environment. My ass. Uh, this program covers all essentials on onboarding costs, fees, yada yada yada. Yeah, $1.2 billion in fucking debt, yes. Mm hmm. Salvage goals. Uh, new access to the mackerel station hopper and mackerel light cargo ships. Okay, sounds interesting. Uh, spare and you. Safeguarding against death. Uh, Alright, doesn't matter. Sure, just see what's up. This screen shows which ships you have access to. Each morning, you can choose to continue working on the ship. Each morning. Or start a fresh one. Yeah, so fresh one. one. And we'll get to work. Uh, sure, let's go with the station hopper. Why not? She's all yours, Cutter. Your primary goal is to reach rank three. Now try to remember. Nanocarbon goes in the processor. Aluminum goes in the furnace. Try to salvage the entire ship if you can. We call it using the whole buffalo. You'll hit your surface faster that way and start knocking out that debt of yours. I'll be observing and giving you any help if you need it. Good luck, Cutter. We were out. We never had light bulbs before. Okay. Where is the airlock? Alright. If I remember rightly, you get inside the ship, we we'll fuck around, cut some shit up, and we we'll toss shit around. Uh, where's the timer on this thing? Do I have a timer? Wait, hold on. Alright, so... I know these ships look intimidating to scrap at first. Trust me. Soon enough, you'll be stripping the huge gecko glass freighters like nothing. Actually, it's not that bad. Salvaging back down our side. In a droid scrap of this. <laughs> you know what made me come up here? <laughs> One day, we got a batch of this particular model in. One of them kinds with synthetic skin and everything. Ah, we good. We almost never saw people looking ones like that. They're always too expensive to manufacture. Seems someone found a warehouse full of them. Mothball for, oh, 20 years or so. Since the AI band took effect. Probably bought the whole lot for pennies, thinking they could turn a tidy profit with the salvage. No word of a lie. These things look exactly like my stepbrother Jed. 
He even had the same slack-jawed expression. <laughs> now, Jed and I wasn't exactly pals or nothing, but all the same, I couldn't bring myself to start smashing that dopey face. And that's when I looked into getting on with Lynx. I'll tell you what, it's a sight better to cut up something that doesn't look like a family relation. I anyway, don't know what to I'm say to that. I'll clear the channel. Call if there's anything giving you grief up there, Cutter. We were out. Salvage goal cleared. Rewards allocated. I mean, that's probably a good thing if you can't stand the idea of cutting up something that looks similar to your family. I guess that would turn one's stomach once or twice. So, more power to you. But, ugh. Come on. Eh, fuck it. Oh, here we go. This is how much I'm spoiled. I'm so used to having that extra long beam on this. Ugh, I'm going to have to actually take my time. Methodically... Then again, at the same time, having a short range tool like this can be useful in its own right. Alright, so this is red, so it goes. Oh, yeah! No, I'm not red! I'm yellow! Alright, that goes in. Uh, ooh, wait, is this loose? Ah, yes! You're going straight into the fire pits of hell! Good, that's done. That means I can flow this into this. Alright, now can you go? Yep, you're moving. Now you can go. Oh wait. There you go. Processing object. Applying credit to account. Oh, we're good. We're good. Yeah, this is not so hard. 